Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to do this video for you on December faves and I wanted to share with you some of my favorite things. These are going to be simple things, nothing over the top because that's my word and my name of the game right now is simplicity. I'm aiming to make everything as simple as I can in my life right now. Please don't mind my hoarder mess back there. I'm getting ready to film a meal prep video and I'm gonna be making some really awesome freezer meals. And so I have all my ingredients laid out. But I wanted to share with you some of the things I'm really loving right now and that I think you might be able to love too on your journey and just to make things simple, a little easier. Um, one of the things that I am really focused on for this year is simplifying our life with our things, our meals, our home, everything. I want everything to be peaceful, simple, as much as possible. I think we overcomplicate things and we're bombarded with so many things. And so I don't make a lot of these videos because I, number one, I'm kind of a minimalist. I don't really like to have a lot of things and I um, am not really into like out spending money and things like that. But these are some things that I think might help you and be really good self care things and help you in this season that we're in right now. And a lot of them can be found on Amazon and um, some other places. So I'll show you what these are, basic things. The first thing you guys know, I'm obsessed with my super cubes. I have them all behind me here and I am not sponsored in any way on this video. These are all things that I have bought I wanted to share with you guys, but without further ado, I thought I would share these super cubes with you because these help me so much with my freezer meal planning. So what I like to do is I like to cook things and then, well, I usually cook dinners and then I, if I have leftovers, I put them in the super cubes and freeze them. And they're these silicone things. You can also bake in them and they freeze. And then what you do is these are the two cups so these are awesome if you wanna make little lasagnas, things like that. And now I had bariatric surgery, and so this is a great way for me to manage my portions. And my favorite ones are the one cup increments. Okay, this is a lot of food. If you actually put this in a bowl, like a hearty meal of one cup, that's very filling. Even for me, three years after I had gastric sleeve surgery, this is very fulfilling for me, one cup. That being said, my husband, it is not enough for him. He prefers, I asked him, I said, do you think you prefer the two cup? And he said, no, that's a little too much. They do have a half cup. I don't know that I would buy these. Um, I bought these and I don't use it as much, but I think it could be handy. If you're making meals and you need to make it like for my husband, I would freeze one cup and then some half increments so he can take a cube out of the freezer. So you freeze them in these, and then when they're frozen like a brick, you pop them out and put them in a Ziploc. And I'll show you how that works. So these are fajitas. We had leftover fajitas, and instead of putting them in my fridge to die and mold, which happens sometimes, I freeze them right away so that I have future meals. So there will come a day where I'm like, you know what, I don't know what to cook for lunch, I don't know what to cook for dinner. I've got tons of super cubes frozen. So I put these right in these one cup increments. I just tucked all the meat and veggies and everything in there and froze it. And then when it was frozen, I popped it out. I've got them labeled. Um, the date, what it is, you will think you will remember what it is, I promise you, you will not. <laughs> so always put what it is and the date. And then they thaw out perfect and everyone asks how I heat them up. Sometimes I heat them in my instant pot. Sometimes I use a pan, sometimes I use a microwave. Just depends on what it is, where I'm at with time and everything like that. So you can freeze things in um, 
the two cup which I don't use these a ton. If I make something that I know I can heat up for my whole family, I really like these because two cups, two of these are perfect for my family of four to have a meal. So these are handy for that. If I had to say my favorite size would be the one cup. Buy the two, I'll link it down below. The two, two pack of these are awesome. And if you get serious about meal prepping, you're gonna want like at least four of them. You see my collection, I'm not ashamed. <laughs> I'm not ashamed, I love them so much. So these are all, because I have them clean because I'm about to meal prep. So these are all that I have here. I've got um, eight of the one cups, two of the two cups, and then one of the half cups. And so I'm gonna be using these this weekend. I'm making uh, some meals for my husband too. And he's, sorry about that light guys. He's gonna have, um, so I need to make some halves for him because he will do one and a half and I do one cups. Another thing that Super Cube has are these cookie tray molds. These, these are very multi-purpose. I feel like QVC right now, I'm so sorry, but I'm just really excited because I love these. And I, and I bought these myself, so I love them. I do make um, cookie doughs in here so that if I wanna make cookies some night, I can make you know, just a little bit of cookies and not like four dozen cookies because then I will eat them all, you know what I'm saying? So this keeps it um, better to do in increments. Another thing I like to do is freeze uh, yogurt in these for smoothies. I also like to freeze, um, I like to make Molly homemade dog treats in these and freeze them and that's awesome too. So these are awesome if you are um, bariatric and you need to make little portions of things. These are awesome, you guys. You can make little soups, little things like that because you know we just eat little increments when we have surgery. So these cookie molds, don't think outside the box here. Not just for cookies. If you have tomato paste, you can freeze them in these. There's a lot of things you can do with these and these are awesome. So moving on, I just spent like six minutes talking about super cubes and I'm not mad about it because I love you super cubes. They do know I exist because I talk to them and tell them how amazing they are, but you know, whatever. The next thing is peppermint tea. This helps me so much with cravings at night, you guys. A lot of you ask me all the time, how do I deal with sugar cravings at night? And my answer to that is peppermint tea. I get this at um, the grocery store. I think I got this at Walmart and um, I, I'm actually going to be making my own this year. I'm really excited about that. I am growing a lot of different things that I'm gonna be making into loose leaf teas and follow along for that because I'm excited to do that and I bought some things to make my teas and steep them. Cause I'm a big tea drinker but I don't necessarily want all the chemicals in the teas and I don't really know what is in here. It says um, ingredients peppermint but it's also got the tea bag and it's got, I don't know. So I also think I can do it a lot cheaper myself. It's, it's like 250 a box. And if I grow all my own stuff, way cheaper to make tea, teas in bulk. So stay tuned for that. If you're interested in that, I would love to share that with you. But I do love peppermint tea at night for cravings. I think that is a big help. The next thing that I really love are my Fresh Jack seasonings. I'm gonna move my camera down a little. You guys, I love my Fresh Jack seasonings. I have to say, this is my most favorite one that we just tried. I don't know if you can see that very good. This is the Campfire Smoky Sea Salt. It is so, so good. You can see we've already dug into that. Um, we used this on some potatoes the other day and we roasted it. And then I got some others that I'm really excited to try. Fresh Bay, this Rosy Cheeks Maple Bourbon Barbecue is so good, you guys. I really love Fresh Jacks. This isn't sponsored, of course, but they're a family company and they make really awesome organic spices. So you definitely, definitely want to check them out. I will link a, um, a link down below where you can get them for 15% off if you are interested. And you can get like packs of five in a gift pack if you wanna gift it to someone. I like to send those out to people because I really love doing that. The next thing I'm gonna share with you, if I can find it, I think it's over here. Yeah, my Ninja Foodie, you guys. I'm not gonna take my tripod off, but you guys, that Ninja Foodie is so awesome. We're just starting to dig into it and use it for um, air frying. Uh, we eliminated our air fryer and we're using that instead. I was excited because I wanna dehydrate things in it. I want to make my own fruit leather for my kids. I wanna make dehydrated apples, things like that. So I'm really excited about that because I wanna get into more dehydration and things like that with all the things that we're growing this spring and I'm excited about that. The next thing I wanted to share with you guys, 
is it's on my phone so i have to send it to you show it to you but i'm listening to jay shetty's book on audible and it's called think like a monk this is a really good book you guys i got it on audible because i love his voice it's very soothing he is um english so he has this accent and when he's talking it's just just so calming and so it's called think like a monk he just has a great personality he's very upbeat and positive he used to be a monk now he's married i think he lives in new york or something but awesome awesome ebook and he has some really neat perspectives on things and so that makes a really good gift or just a gift for yourself because it's a really good book and i think you should check it out next thing i'm really into is planning and journaling guys i'm really really using that as a um personal growth and development tool my favorite journals are from um, peggy bear and i will link her down below she does hand, this is hand painted you guys this is art and she's amazing she will she made this um 12 month calendar for me which i use to um kind of map out my year and if you're interested in a video on that, definitely let me know down below. I was going through my 2020 book and I was amazed at all the things I mapped out and how I over exceeded them and made more goals than I thought I did. So I think it's really important to be a visionary and map out your life and you know write out your dreams and everything like that. And I love, love, love her journals. She is the best by far. I have been purchasing for her for four years now she is a game changer and love 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 her work i cannot speak enough about her heart she will oftentimes you know send a gift to um i think she sent a journal to my mom when my brother passed away she's just a sweet lady guys support her company if you're looking for hand painted journals the next thing i love 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 right now you guys know i hit that protein goal every day is my thrive protein um i do the lavelle thrive vitamin patch and their capsules and their protein every morning it's my routine and i love this so much this is the candy cane flavor i don't know if it's going to be around all year but last year i bought like six boxes because i'm that serious about my candy cane flavor it tastes like mint chocolate chip ice cream and if you've tasted a lot of protein powders you know that most of them are nasty and this one actually tastes really good and it's so easy to make so it has i know because i know someone's going to ask me it has um 15 grams of protein so what i do is i fill my uh, cup with 10 ounces of very cold water, a couple ice cubes in there, put this in there, shake it up, and I'm having mint chocolate chip ice cream for breakfast in a shake. Winning. I, I don't know how else to tell you other than it tastes really good. I'm not, I like all the other flavors okay, but I just buy this one because it's so good. And I was thinking about my favorites and I was like, well, I'm gonna share that with you because it tastes good. Another thing is we're all wearing masks and going out in public and it just wreaks havoc on our on our face and our skin and our lips and so this is the best thing you guys if you have really chapped lips i'm usually a burt's bees girl but with all this mask wearing and stuff it's really taking a toll on my face so this is awesome it's aquaphor i got this at target but i'll link it on amazon i usually buy it on amazon but i was at target the other day when i got this um so for severely dry lips so burt's bees are good for every day but when you're if you're out and about and you're just, you know, this is awesome, awesome, awesome stuff. So that's it for my favorites, guys. I kept it simple, I kept it basic, cause that's just really what I'm living right now is basic simplicity and things to help you on your journey. I hope these things help you. I love Super Cubes, if you didn't tell, couldn't tell. Guys, they don't even sponsor me. I just love them so much. I mean, if you wanna sponsor me, Michelle and Jake, you can. You can just send me more Super Cubes. <laughs> because <laughs> i'm obsessed so anyway guys i hope you are doing awesome be sure to subscribe and give a thumbs up because i'm about to meal prep some awesome lunches and you might get some ideas for that so stay tuned for more videos on that you can go back and look at my other meal planning stuff too if you like this video let me know down below and let me know where you're at on your journey bye guys Whoa, oh.